Welcome back to the Last Remnant video walkthrough. We've wrapped up the main quest plot for the six bases and uh, uh, Königsdorf uh, in the last video. Um, and in this one, we are going to be doing uh, two quests. Um, actually, the next, this video and the next one, we're going to be working on getting the summons for our other leaders, uh, both Jaeger and Emmy. And this video is going to have two quests in it, um, Tablet of Marshall and the Slave Traders. Sir Rush, Dr. Marina is waiting for you in Atham Castle. It seemed urgent. <laughs> Guess I better go. Then please come this way. I think he means your mother. Oh, there you are, Rush. Do you have a moment? As you know, your Marquis friend has been ordered by the Duke of Gore to gather remnants from around the world. Now, it's a bit forward of me, but I've been thinking about how you can do this, and I've hit upon a good idea. You can use the Tablet of Marshall. With it, you can change unbound remnants to talismans and take them with you. If the remnants are in my, our possession, it means the Conqueror can't get his hands on them, correct? Either way, the first matter of business is to retrieve the tablet. It should still be in Marshallton. Rush, you'll come with me and get it, right? No problem, Mom. Thank you, honey. Let's head to Marshallton. And by Marshallton, they just mean uh, Numer Mine. Um, I don't know why they call it two things. Um, but this is, once again, an opportunity for your mom to try and kill you. Um, I, I said in a previous video, when we fought Nimmel near him the first time, uh, which your mother sent, uh, sent at us, uh, she's trying to kill us. Uh, she wishes you were a daughter and um, just holds a great deal of hatred for you. Uh, so I know that doesn't come through in the main uh, quest plot, but it's all true. Okay, so we are still trying to avoid mobs whenever possible. Um, uh, it, firstly, so it won't artificially raise our BR. We're about to get our final two of our 18, and then we really won't care um, how, many how many guys we hit. But uh, for right now, uh, we'd like to hold off going blitz crazy until uh, we get to our last two of our final 18. And um, that doesn't mean that we're not going to hit guys that are annoyingly in our way. Okay, so there's a chest back here. Uh, nope. Nope. I'm thinking of another door. Uh, let's see. We've gone to the undeveloped uh, zone. Uh, New Vermont, uh, we've been here before. There's like uh, four areas to it, and I mentioned um, it's a nice dungeon crawl to do them. Uh, I think this might be the last video where um, I, I don't fast forward these uh, elevators. Like um, later on in the videos, I get so bored of uh, us sitting here on this elevator moving slowly that I speed it up so it looks cartoonishly fast. Um, we still want to try and pick up uh, every chest and ground spawn uh, we can. Come on out! Ring recipe, nice. Uh, okay, later. That's going to allow us to craft a certain type of ring. Uh, and we will be trying to collect all those. Uh, the um, last time we were here, we picked up the Tablet of Marshall. Um, what that's going to allow us to do is there are five remnants around the world um, where we use this tablet on them. Uh, the Stone of Marshall. Maybe that's what I got last time. I got the Stone of Marshall. This time we're going to get the Tablet of Marshall. Um, what that tablet's going to allow us to do is to activate these remnants and give them to our guys. Um, there are five total. Uh, four of them we can get now. Uh, two of them go to two, uh, to our final 18. Uh, the other two go to Violet and Nora, who aren't in our final 18, so we don't bother with them. Uh, we may get them later just to say we've gotten everything in the game, but I think I do it in a later video just because it's not important. It's not any of our final 18. Uh... Let's see. In this video, we're going to get the Rubber Soul and the Skiavana. You're here. Are you ready for me to open the doors? Sure am. That's what I like to hear. Now let's see if we can't kill you. Okay, so the last time we were here, it was Emma and us, and, and just Emma and Rush only. 
These are the guardians of Marshalton, Nimmelsen and Nim Narumsum. They continue to protect the tablet held in this town, as they have for generations. In other words, we'll have to defeat them if we're to take the tablet. Rather, you will. I can't interfere this time. This is something you have to do. Oh, go rush. Face this challenge with honor. Show me the young man you've become. Oh, boy. So, um, I'm not paranoid, right? She she has full control over this thing, and uh, because she's Marion Marshall's uh, granddaughter or whatever, but uh, she's still going to make us fight it for the second time. Well, anyway, what I was saying before is we fought this with Emma and Rush before, and it was a marathon, 28-rounder, because we did such little damage. Um, well, here we got a much tougher version of it, and we are... But we've got all 18 of, um, 18 guys with us, so it's going to go quick. I mean, I think it goes down in two rounds or something. Damn. Spoiler alert. Um, okay, so let me talk about the um, the three uh, remnants that we're going to get with the Tablet of Marshall that we're worried about. Um, one of them is a rubber sole. It's a Dillmore, and it goes to uh, Glennis. It's an accessory she'll pick up. Um, the Skiavana is for Jaeger. It's a weapon for him. It jumps his weapon tree all the way to the top, and he is a beast with it. Um, although it kind of looks like a baton uh, until he upgrades it uh, once or twice more. Um, uh, it eventually looks manly enough for Jaeger to... Uh, actually, right as soon as he gets it in this video, though, he's going to look like he's leading a marching band. But um, we're, we're okay with that. There's not uh, streamers coming off the side of it or anything like that. Okay, so this Nemelnirum's dead. And I think we're pretty much done with Nemelnirums. This is going to give Emmy the ability to uh, summon and control Nemelnirum in battle, just like Rush has Cyclops. So now we've got two summons. And I don't c consider David's uh, Gibbolg a summon, since it doesn't fight for you and block for you. It's not a group. So, blam! Just like that, Emmy got a little hook up there. Obtain tablet. Obtain Namalnirum. What's this tablet? With this tablet, you may change a remnant to a talisman. Of course, you can only use the tablet on a blank remnant, one that's unbound. I really didn't want to take the tablet from this place, but with things as they are, there's no other choice. Rush, the future of the world's remnants may be of the whole world, could come down to you and your actions. I'll be praying for your success. Despite that heavy speech, don't ever do it, all right? Just be sure to come back to me in one piece, understood? Very strange behavior from Mother. Uh, one, in one breath, she's telling you to, um, you know, die in battle, and the other one, she's saying, uh, be careful out there. Boston's definitely combat. Emmy is definitely combat. No, yes, Emmy will ask for the Night Bloom because Irina is gone. <laughs> so we finally got Emmy to ask for the Night Bloom, uh, and this is the time to do it uh, while Irina is out of the party uh, due to the main quest. So once we got this uh, Tablet of Marshall, we're going to go over here and pick up two of them, uh, the two I mentioned before that we're going for. Um, so I said there's two we're going to use, and then there's two for two guys that aren't in our 18 that we're not going to use, but um, there's one more. There's a fifth. And we can't get it yet. It's for Irina. It's called the Dead Heart, but there's a Dead Heart quest for later, and we'll need we'll need to leave it where it is. Otherwise, we can't do that quest, and we can't get 100% completion. So we're gonna have to put that fifth remnant on hold. Uh, we've actually visited these remnants before. Um, usually, somebody yelled about, "Oh, it's gonna collapse," or "There's gonna be a collapse," or something like that. And, um, this was like the second main quest uh, where we uh, and the generals all came up here and fought the giant tree guy. Uh, we also came up here for a morsel, but the first time we were up here we were at this thing here. Come on out. I don't know what I'm doing there. Oh, ring recipe one. Oh, okay. okay. Something I should have picked up a long time ago. So yeah, here's the uh, item. Table tablet of Marshall's reacting to the rubber soul. Use the tablet? Yeah. So they don't automatically put you in a battle, it's just, boom. 
you picked it up, put it in your inventory, rubber sole. And uh, Glennis will enjoy that, and only Glennis will enjoy that. Uh, these remnant uh, items we pick up... Oh, there's a chest. I don't know how we missed that chest. Well, probably because it broke into cutscene the last time we were up here. Um, but yeah, uh, these uh, Tablet of Martial remnants that we're giving to uh, our people are only for one specific person. Um, so you can kind of choose based on what your final 18 or final 7 or whatever are, uh, whether you want to do it. Uh, the second one we're going to pick up is a Skiavana, and that is the one we need post-haste. Uh, Jaeger, when we got him, uh, while he did get, he does have that Beowulf where he's killed a couple bosses straight out with it, um, we're going to give him another ability that he'll get just by having this weapon, the Skiavana. And the name of the ability is Skiavana. Uh, yeah. Dodging these guys is always a pain in the soon. But in order to get to this one, it requires us to go through the entire uh, uh, where is this? Blackdale. Blackdale area. We gotta go all the way to the cuspid post where it dead ends. Uh, if you remember before, there was a scene where Wagram uh, was calling us an idiot, which could have been any cutscene with Wagram, but in this particular cutscene with Wagram calling us an idiot, um, <clears throat> he summoned a monster against us. Okay, that's every cutscene. Okay. In this cutscene, there was a giant sword hanging from the ceiling, and uh, Irina was nearly unconscious. So now I've narrowed it down to like three, three uh, possible Wagram scenes it could be. Uh, we picked up a morsel from here before. Um, uh, it should be coming back to you. As soon as you see the dead end, you'll remember uh, Wagram and Jaeger were over here. Um, unfortunately, to get to that remnant hanging from the ceiling, uh, I'm not going to try and dodge. I'm not going to try and be crafty. Uh, I'm just going to grab them all. And this is uh, one of the earlier zones, so we uh, should be able to one-round these guys. It's less than five groups. It's six. Oh man. Oh, Nemo near him. We'll hit that just because uh, it came up for uh, Emmy, and we'll see it here. I won't be using Nemo near him a lot in videos because um, it doesn't have a lot of hit points. It doesn't do a lot of damage. Uh, and it's some about something else you've got to watch. Uh, somebody else you got to heal. It's uh, not always a good idea to waste your turn and summon. And that's essentially what the group does when Emmy chooses to summon, or Rush chooses to summon instead of attack. Oh, oh nice. Okay. Paige is going to pick up the slack here. Did we even get a chance to... Hey, I wonder if uh, that bird survived because it was able to fly. Like, maybe uh, Paige's uh, battlefield clearing ability only works on people who can touch the ground. Okay, and here I'm an idiot and have trouble getting it to show up. It's not coming up. Should get a cursor over it, um, but it requires some camera trickery. And at some point I'm like, well, maybe this is it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing there. Hey, there's 97 gold. Hot damn. Pay dirt. I don't know where I'm going. Metal, there it goes. There it goes. Got it to show up. The tablet of Marshall's reacting to the Skiavana. Use the tablet. Hell yes. And now Jaeger, who came with us a little late, is going to get a weapon that's going to help him uh, help him compete with the guys who did the PC Ultimate grind. Yeah, that Skiavana's a huge upgrade for him. And uh, though that is an in-tier... In uh, weapon, it does upgrade twice more to like a Skiavana Virtus and a Skiavana Arcanus or something like that. Okay, so we're done with this uh, remnant hunting. Uh, we'll continue that later uh, when it's less important. Now we can continue on to the next quest, the Slave Traders. Uh, this one is in Nagapur. 
And this is going to open the aqueducts for us. Uh, that's one reason why we want to do it. I can't find my little sister anywhere, and she knows she ain't big enough to go anywhere by herself. But I've been all over town. I don't know what else to do. And I sure can't trust some stupid old adult to help. But you, you ain't so old. Please, you got to help me find my sister. She's all I got. Don't worry, I'll find her. Thanks a million. So there's this Oswald geezer, and he knows, like, everything in Nagapur. I bet he could help. I'll stay here. Okay, so you don't want an adult's help, but you want us to go ask an even older adult. Okay. Or he doesn't want to move. He's lazy. Another lazy quest giver. Uh, Oswald is upstairs, I believe. In the pub. And there's something important about Oswald. Uh, we'll find out later. Oh ho! Finally I meet the renowned Rush Sykes. Excellent timing. Timing for what? Recently a group of slavers has made its way into the city that may be a familiar. Seems the group used to operate outside of Athel. The slavers hide in the aqueducts, yet while I know their hideout's location, I haven't strength enough to dispose of the fiends. But now, a vile youth with a strong sense of justice has come straight to my door. Can I entrust you with a task? Would you go to the aqueduct? I'm about it. Excellent. I will take you to the entrance. Slave traders. Same slave traders we did in the first quest. Uh, well, the first uh, side quest with Balson. And we've been to the aqueduct before, but this quest uh, unlocks the zone for us. Uh, so we can come in our free time. This quest also does something that makes it worthwhile. Uh, it opens up a shop in Nagapur, uh, which you uh, may choose to... Oh, there's a glassy lobelis right above us. Uh, you may want a time shift. And, and they're almost always there. I mean, maybe always there. Yeah, I'm just going to say they're always there. It's very rare that they're not there. So you may want to time shift right when you go through the door. You may not be able to see their tail hanging down. They got a lot of hit points and they slow you up, so it's better just to shift on through. Alright, so this may look a little familiar because we've been this way before. Um... And it won't be the last time we come this way. Anyway, the name of the, the uh, shop that opens up in Nagapur is Gifts of Remembrance. And they don't offer a whole bunch of items, but you may want to... Um, it may be worth it to check that shop out after you've done this quest. And there are chests uh, that we saw the last time we were through here also that we did not get because we were so worried about our um, BR. All right, and there's a rare that we have to get much later here for a guild task, and it's a pain to spawn. Um, I, the only reason I tell you is that if you see a lobster right there on that platform named lobster, just kill it. Kill it no matter what, because it's uh, a long trip. That entire run from the front entrance to here is, is and you got to do it about 20 or 30 times to guarantee that he shows up. Um, if you ever see him, kill him. Um, can't remember his name right off the bat. Rock something, maybe. Um, but it's a little lobster uh, crab guy. Just a heads up. It's worth it to kill that named if you see him on that platform. Okay. Got some guys standing here. the hell do you want? Hand over the girl. So, there's still a couple idiots with balls in this town after all, but you picked the wrong time to get all high and mighty. Boys, grab these little punks. They're going to be the latest additions to our inventory. Slavers never learn. It's like... And now we're fighting some guy we whipped their ass earlier, and now there's 18 more of us than there were when we... Uh, or 16 more of us than there were the last time we whipped their ass, and uh, they want to fight us again. This this just goes to prove uh, uh, my point I was making earlier that uh, we should 
the game should kill whoever you whoever you attack in battle. There should be no friendship ending. They should all be fatalities, and uh, that will prevent us from fighting the same guys over and over and over and over again. Um, it's nice that we fight the Enlightened Seven again, and they're much tougher. And it's a, uh, a huge challenge in this game, uh, but uh, not not having to redo every quest mob again in another quest. If we would have killed, if we would have killed them the first time, they wouldn't be uh, uh, kidnapping young girls again. All right. So uh, there's not much to say about this quest. I believe we had access to it uh, right after the Nagapur incident. Um, so we've we've been able to do it for a while, but we're waiting to do it till now. Um, in the next uh, video, we're going to get the last summon. There's only three people who can summon in the game, and uh, uh, Jaeger needs to get his uh, Lob Omen, and then we'll be all set. All set. And Jaeger will be really hooked up. He'll have a summon. He just got Beowulf in the video before last, and he just got Skiavani in this video. Uh, so he's, uh, he's dancing. And that's one of the things that makes Jaeger like, a great uh, group leader right away. Because as soon as you can get Jaeger, you can get all his... Uh, all his accessories. And the sla slaver's dead. Again. Or, I'm sorry, maybe incapacitated until we have to fight him again. This is of no concern to you. Get some stat ups. Some stat ups. You got my sister back. I really owe you, mister. Well done, Rush Sykes. Here's a little something to show my appreciation. Linen belt and 500, uh, 5,000 gold. This should bring Nagapur back into balance. Hmm, it seems that even this old man can still be of some use. How so? How is he helpful? Alright, uh... Yeah, we're gonna just pop out to the world map, answer a bunch of questions for our 18. Rubber soul for Glennis. Yes. Yes. And uh, this is all we're doing in this video. Um, so I'll wrap it up there, and I'll see you in the next one.